Hi, my name is Angel Kolkowit. I am a journalism student from Mercer. I am a junior and currently I am doing all of my classes online because of the coronavirus or COVID-19. Today is April the 1st. It is 11, 12 p.m. and pretty much all I've done today is nap and then work on homework and then nap again and then work on more homework. Pretty much that's what most of my days end up looking like are me trying to find the ways to fill the time and then me working on my homework. There's been a lot more assignments that I wasn't expecting, so um, the only things that I really have to look forward to anymore are um, when my friend gets to come over and sometimes watch TV shows with us, but that's going to stop soon. So it's just going to be me alone with my family. I'm not excited about that. I'm not looking forward to that at all. My dad said that um, he's going to stop us from being able to leave the house soon, that we're not going to be allowed to. I'm not ready for that. I don't know if I can handle that. <laughs> so on day two, the governor has ordered a shelter in place that will go in effect, I believe, today. So what that means is that we will not be allowed to leave our houses except to get groceries um pretty much until next week i think it's april the 13th whenever that stops and he made that announcement earlier in the day and so i think it goes into effect for friday so we went to chick-fil-a because it would be our last time getting chick-fil-a for a long time and now we just wait. Alrighty, so it is 9.52 in the morning and I never wake up this early to be honest. So uh, props to me for that, I suppose. And um, I'm about to make myself a nice little bath because honestly, mentally, I'm not doing that great. And then we're gonna go from there. Hey Rosie, what are we doing? Work in general. It's a lot going on. It's hard. Before they realize how killing. Well, I'm trying to people come to that thing. They'll come out of Atlanta and everywhere if that thing. So, you're on the phone, tell your mom I don't want to see you. She just watches Facebook. Hey guys, so basically, after my, um, after we roasted marshmallows, I went inside and went to sleep, and I slept until about noon. <laughs> I mean, I woke up throughout it, but it just kind of feels like lately, what's the point of having a schedule if there's nothing to kind of base it off of? So during the weekends, I do tend to just sleep in and do whatever. So it is the first official, like, full day of shelter in place. And I'm so bored. I'm incredibly bored. My dad is at home. I don't know where he went. I'm guessing he went to work. Um, but my mom and my sister are home. They leave for her to get chemo again tomorrow. And then they are going to be moving into my, the apartment at my grandmother's house. Like the mother-in-law suite that like no longer, my granny passed away a few years ago. So she no longer lives in there. So they are going to be moving into there, which I guess is good. But it's still just kind of a stressful situation for everyone, I think. So, yeah, nothing too exciting has been happening lately, except for the fact that we are now living under a shelter-in-place order. Fun times. <laughs> Hi guys, so today I slept in until 2, and then called my friend, and then got bored and cut a mullet-ish. And now I'm calling another friend and we're watching Netflix, and that's literally how almost every day goes for me. People are pretty much just continuing life as normal and just not going to the movies. Uh, it's not going super well. It's not a very effective order. Um, yeah, I'm kind of confused by all of it. It was a very uh, nondescript and 
none of the things were explained that needed to be explained about what even is an essential service but I've been home for two days three days without leaving the house for groceries or anything like that and I've been social distancing dash quarantining and only leaving for groceries for the past several weeks so my brother's out getting me some food <laughs> exciting stuff <laughs>